Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Will Conquer 4 and today we are going to review the Will Conquer 4 Carbon World mod by Zen Muslim. But before we starting to review the mod, let's just say that uh, I do not affiliate with any uh, political individuals or uh, has any types of you know interest in different politics because uh, before before I review this mod, I have you know seen some comments saying that the modder is you know is a uh, kind of a bias or maybe an extremist or anything related to him and just just let that you know this is a personal preferences uh, whether he's uh, extremist or he's a nationalist or whatever he is it's his choice it is his uh, passion it's his uh, political view so you guys do not have the right to you know insult him well it's it depends on him actually because he's the one that decide which way is his view and for me as a you know a, a player a gamer i appreciate people effort on doing something and i do not mind their political agenda at all so again just keep it in mind we are going to be you know playing the game uh, make the community a bit more safe a bit more fun you know sharing and playing the mod all together so without further ado let's go into the scenario so uh, basically, same thing. You guys can get the unlimited, uh, you know, kind, uh, unlimited, you know, points like coins, you know, energy by just going to the legion and buy everything. Also, for uh, the unlimited medals, you guys can go for the tutorial. I think yeah, one thousand. And also, the generals are cheap. You know, really, really cheap. Yeah, really, really cheap. You can get a wood chick. Uh, who's this guy? Uh, ben Salah, we have uh, Lukashenko, you know, we got uh, Kaputova, we got Prakir Chanucha, we got uh, Jean Bokov, you know, a new face, Paho, Abbas, uh, A. Morales, and Adam, Meira, Radev, Levitz, Dodon, Morrison, you know, Osan Suchi, uh, Wokzut, uh, Keita, Maki, Machi, Makri, Duoto, Meta, you know, many other generals, so Ingvan, uh, Penera, uh, oh, this is something new. Enter Chris, not a general at all, but some kind of a, uh, you know, a, a, a figure. Madi, Sanchez, you know, Salin, Widodo from uh, 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 Indonesia, Zelensky, you know, Duda, Modi, Kim Jong Un, Donald Trump, Macron, Xi Jinping, Vladimir Putin, you know, many other more. Uh, really a new face for me. Michelle, Maduro, and Moon Jae in, and Rute. And uh, this is some new faces, Bill Clinton, you know, some Russian generals, Pompeo, Hillary Clinton, Le Pen, you know, many other more. And also some, you know, historical general like Stalin, Napoleon Bonaparte, Adolf, Mussolini, Mustafa Kamel, Atutu, Pasha, Pasha, uh, Abdul, Abdul Lamid, you know, Caesar, Churchill, Mehmed, John de Arc, Vladimir Lenin, you know, Pasha, William II. Uh, Mao Zedong and Sultan. So basically, he's a Turkish, you know, mother, the same as the other Turkish mother. But you know, respect people's choice. Oh, and by the way, by the way, there are also some, you know, generic scenarios. You can check it out. This is called the Operation Olive Branch. The president, uh, Recap uh, Tayyip Erdogan, uh, has decided to launch a military operation in Afrin on January 2018 to clean up terrorists from the YPG and other terrorist group in the cities of Afrin and its surrounding. So basically an unlimited medal. I think you can just take it down. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Yeah. You can tell. Everything just launch, you know, offensive is pretty easy. Also have some American uh, uh, arsenal, you know, to support because you know, like they, they, they supply military from the uh, United States. So basically it's kind of too easy for them just to take it down. Okay, and I haven't yet upgraded anything, so basically this is the damage uh, by itself. The damage is pretty much OP by now. You can also have a new type of, you know, guns or tank. Uh, helicopter is also part of the new game right now. It's a new thing, you know. Uh, basically, we are surrounding them, so pretty easy. Yeah, let's just play some games. You know. Holy Branch. show my okay this is some something similar to Japanese you know uniform Japanese troops but anyways I uh, love the animations animation is pretty okay pretty quick uh, not so slow 
uh, good rhythm I can say that good rhythm uh, the flow everything is great no lag and good thing uh, one more thing is the the flag uh, I, maybe I never seen it before but the flag looks so neat kind of reminds me of the old Vietnamese uh, flag for a really really long time oh we also got the m60 patent which is supplied by the american i think they still use their old tanks you know, but since they, they don't have anyone to you know buy from so basically this is a type of tank it should be useful for further you know military exercise i think you know they still use the m brands but who knows okay so the enemy basically try to take some other troops so we just try to take them out Okay, let's take this one in and turn. Let's play some games. It's better than doing just a review. Take that one. Bam. Bam. And take that. And go into the lot. And take this one. Really nice. Um, tank. Let's let's a tank go first. Till we about later. Without without any upgrades. Damage is already that great, so I believe you don't really need any further upgrades at all. Or maybe if you wanted to, uh, let's just take that in. Okay, let's set some troops. Oh, we have soldier, police special force, Grandemia special force, maroon barrett, helicopters. You got the BMC 235-16P, M48 Payton 1948-M60, uh, M stands for Main Battle Tank, uh, M48 uh, year 1948, uh, Payton 1960, Payton, uh, also Leopard 2A7 from Germany, pretty good though. We also got the BGM from Russia, M2270, yeah, it's pretty good though, a really new upgrade, but it's awesome. Really, really nice. Even the tanks now has a virus. Back in the days, rarely people mod uh, with new features. But now, since modding is pretty challenging, people want to show uh, how skilled they are. So we, we can see a lot of different mods. But also, the mod is pretty fun. People enjoy it, some people don't. It depends, you know. Some people are, uh, are being too sensitive towards some other modder, uh, regardless of their political views and many other stuff. So it's kind of a lost situation for most modder. Uh, but you know, like I said, you, we, we should not condemn them by their own political views. But besides, we support them since we are in the same communities. But I don't think that people can really listen to me. I'm just trying to be nice and trying to, you know, explain people how things would go if we all work together. Okay, we got the rat right here. Let's have a look at the uh, 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 air support. We got a new. Oh, we got switching bombing on a stealth. Yeah, this one is a stealth. Let's see if we can see that. Let's let's, let's try that one. Let's try that one. Okay, new graphics, really nice. I, I love, I love the uh, uh, cell. I, I don't know how to call that. The B fifty two cell or just the cell. Cell. Mm, let's check it out. Let's say that and that. Okay. Good. Only a few more left. Yes. Okay. Turn. Good. Let's take that. Nice. So pretty much, if you play as Turkey, it's pretty easy for you. Because the modder is Turkey. For example, like the Great Pictic War mod, uh, the modder is Romanian. It's not really easy just to take Bucharest. It's it's take forever. Like freaking forever, man. But it's pretty fun. It's pretty challenging. It's genre now people enjoy getting challenging uh, it's pretty fun you know people share their thoughts how strong how weak they are it's just part of uh, people daily thing you know let's capture that and another one 
Okay, victory of unlimited medals. Hemiji Castle in Japan. Maybe you can you can see new stuff. Oh, another Olivia branch. Okay. Oh no 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 no! It's it's only one. It's only one. Yes, yeah, only one. It's pretty bad. Uh, special scenarios. Olivia branch. We should have seen more, but uh, let's let's try. Same thing, same thing, yeah, same thing, but World War II. 3, uh, 2019. Okay, let's have a look at the conquest. So the conquest, uh, we have so many stuff to look at, first of all. I uh, just want to say that we only have three. 2019's Road to World War III. 20, 2014, Greater Israel, Turan Union and European Union. 2025, the coming of Mahdi and Jesus. Something religious, you know. Uh, so basically, we still have the same, you know, countries. Cambodia is not playable, but exists. Everybody's here. I love the flag. I love the color. Everything's neat. Uh, I, I already reviewed that one. So 2014, we have European Union. We got the Turan Union. Uh, we still got the Middle East. China will grab everything in. Pretty six, same thing. 20, 20, 20, uh, 2025, uh, we got Dajjal Kingdom, which is a new thing. United Emirates, the Muslim Caliphate, uh, Pakistan got over India, okay. Uh, Vietnam took over Indochina, China still had to fight. Pretty neat, actually, but Zurich, sorry, uh, Switzerland still there. Pretty legit. Let's have a look at the European Union, the EU. Okay, so this is basically the end of the world. So, yeah, 2025. Okay, here's my review. I will give this one a 7.5 out of 10. First of all, only one customized scenarios uh, on campaign. It's not enough to be considered as one of the fun, uh, you know, uh, most playful mod, okay, most play mod, or maybe famous mod. But I appreciate his effort to uh, customize more unit, to customize more tanks, helicopters, you know, nuclear bombs, and many other more. I appreciate that. Uh, and I also appreciate his, you know, his work on conquest. Which is pretty good actually, but he should consider getting more, you know, customized scenarios of conquest, like alternative. You know, uh, there are so many more stuff you can do. Uh, you can check on Google. So many ideas actually. So seven out of five out of ten. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of mod review in the Zen Muslim 2019 current world mod. Also, don't forget to subscribe to his channel. He did his very best to bring the mods to. Today, also a very active, you know, modders in the community. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Leave a like if you do, and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you guys next time.